inshaAllah that anytime a difficulty come to the nation of Sayyidina Muhammad that we pray Allah to grant a relief, take away the immense amount of oppression that facing the nation of Sayyidina Muhammad now in, in Palestine, Rohingya, China, all over the world and until the earth is filled with oppression is a sign that the arrival of Sayyidina Mahdi is so near that oppression in every corner of the earth and in every direction and that the nation of Sayyidina Muhammad is so badly under difficulty. And alhamdulillah that awliyaullah in our lives have given us what to recite for every salah and for every occasion. And alhamdulillah for those who recite salawat the, the fajr awrad, they know that these wazifas, these etiquettes that the shaykhs give to us in our lives are from their reality. That when the Sultan of Saints is giving his students what he recites, it's an immense recitation that it's a munajad, it's a prayer and it's continuous asking from Allah to the presence of Sayyidina Muhammad that every fajr their ruhaniyat is facing Sayyidina Muhammad facing the nation, facing the king and obeying Allah that when the nation are oppressors and when people are oppressors that you run to the presence of the Sultan and ask Allah's forgiveness. So everything they recite is from that reality. Every durood al sharif they, they give to us, every wazifa to recite within our prayers, our fajr prayer, most important of all the prayers. It's an audience with Maqam al Mahmud, with Sayyidina Mahmud alayhi salatu salam. It's a presence in the uh, station to the presence of Sayyidina Muhammad. InshaAllah we'll recite from the salawat and a reminder for everyone to recite these salawats, everyone to recite the fajr awrad because the Sultan is teaching us that we are the caretakers of our brothers and sisters and that we are continuously in every action that we do to be vigilant and praying upon the nation of Sayyidina Muhammad and to whatever they taught is, is so specific and so beatific that even they keep Salat al-Janazat if I been at Salat al-Maghrib which nobody keeps and many people ask, what are you doing? And it's a sunnah and it's a reality of the Salat al-Maghrib at the time when our day begins which is night time that we pray in the Janazat al-Qaibin, the, the janazah for those whom are not present with us as caretakers of the nation of Sayyidina Muhammad that Salat al-Janazah the Qaibin is for Ya Rabbi for all those who are in difficulty. Who are dying or dead, who are hidden under rubble, hidden under dirt, hidden under wherever they are. That you grant a relief to them and that our du'as, our prayers, even our Surat Yaseen is a gift to their souls. For those whom nobody find them and who's going to pray over them. And we make that prayer and we keep and teach that way. So if something should happen to us and that we die in a place where nobody reaches that, that tradition of taking care of each other, watching over each other, praying for each other that somebody will pray for us, our loved ones, our children, our family and our community. Amen. And they came after this and nobody said anything, they came after that one and nobody said anything and they came after me and it was finished. Everyone watches these things and thinking it's far away and it's them. And the next day it's them 
And before you know it, it's you. This is a war against Islam, this is a war against the heavenly kingdom and we pray that Allah send a najat, a salvation, send a relief Amen. and that Sayyidina Muhammad send his holy family upon this earth for this najat and for salvation to reach the earth inshaAllah. For all those whom are suffering under the foot of an immense oppression, immense difficulties, immense hardships, bi hurmati Muhammad al-Mustafa wa bi siri Surat al-Fatiha. Those whom when they see oppression it should activate within their heart although they wish to extinguish the light of Islam and nothing make them happier for you all to die and just go away so that they can enjoy this earth to themselves. When we see these signs it's a time to be proud of your identity, to wear your identity that you don't kill us, we don't die but we multiply. And Islam is going nowhere, Alam al-Islam, the world of Islam will come down onto earth and will be victorious. This is a time in which to motivate your hearts for those whom hiding themselves, shy from their religion, borderline what they're doing with their religion. It's a sign, look how they're killing people and they wish nothing better than you two to all go hide and, and die and go away. So for myself, for my family, my children, for everyone to look at this oppression and to keep the pride of Islam, the Muhammadan way, the Muhammadan identity that, no, no, don't kill us, we just multiply. For the ten people you took out, thousands more will show themselves that they're everywhere. They're to the left of you and they're to the right of you. The only waiting for a sign from Allah we pray that Allah send a relief and a najat inshaAllah upon the nation of Sayyidina Muhammad Bi hurmati Muhammad al-Mustafa wa bi siri Surat al-Fatiha. Ameen. Salat al-Kunjihat, Munajadiyah or how do they pronounce it? Salawat for relief inshaAllah, keep reciting inshaAllah, all of us recite all the time, every fajr, all day long asking for relief for the nation of Prophet A'udhu billahi minash shaytanir rajeem Bismillahir Rahmanir Raheem Allahumma salli ala Sayyidina Muhammadin salatan tunjina
Sadaqallahul Aliyyul Azim Allahumma asli ummati Muhammad Allahumma arhamna ummati Muhammad Allahumma asdur ummati Muhammad Allahumma ikhfil ummati Muhammad Amin Allahumma ahfaz ummati Muhammad Allahumma unzur ummati Muhammad sallallahu alayhi wa sallam Ya Rabbi reconcile the nation of Sayyidina Muhammad sallallahu alayhi wa sallam have mercy upon the nation of Sayyidina Muhammad Veil the imperfection of the nation of Sayyidina Muhammad Allah forgive the nation of Sayyidina Muhammad Allah preserve the nation of Sayyidina Muhammad Allah grant victory, grant victory to the nation of Sayyidina Muhammad Yansurkullahu Nasran Azizah, Yansurkullahu Nasran Azizah, Yansurkullahu Nasran Azizah, Ya Sayf al Haymati wa Zammati wa Jabarud, Tu Quwwati wa Malakud, Bi Madadikum wa Nazarakum, Ya Rabbi Lizza wa Zammati wa Jabarud, Wa Hurmati Muhammad al Mustafa, Masir Surat al Fatiha. Click the link now to subscribe.